Yo, when it gets to the point where you worry that shit you know you're not supposed to be knowing, and it really worries you that with your 90-something subs, motherfuckers gonna knock you the fuck off. Like, share, subscribe, man. Do that whole job. Listen. Especially that subscribe. I don't know why some of y'all unsubscribed. I know it wasn't. It's not consistent enough to where I know I said something I shouldn't have said. You see what I'm saying? I feel it's just people people from my past who uh, subscribed to my channel years ago saw me popping up on their feed and was like, ah, right, fuck this motherfucker. Get him up out of here. <laughs> nah, real shit, though. Um, A lot of people that used to fuck with me that don't fuck with me no more because somewhere along the line, some shit might have happened. Maybe something happened to someone close to them. Maybe not them specifically. I'm not a very well-liked individual sometimes. I'm a heavily flawed individual, put it like that. <laughs> anyway, so I'm doing some readings on the internet yesterday. I don't know why, but some told me, yo, look up, look up Goya and them paintings in his house. Okay, for anyone who don't know, there's a famous painting in, like, the 1700s, 1800s, famous painter named Francisco Goyo. Motherfucker painted a whole bunch of, like, really, like, like, important. Just the portrait this motherfucker had painted for himself, like, was something big. And he didn't even paint that. It was just painted of him. You see what I'm saying? Like, this motherfucker was... He was renowned for, like, the amounts of detail and shit. And, like, I guess when he was dying, he was, like... Sort of losing it and shit. And he like painted shit on the walls of his house. And like there were tw there were 12 paintings I think it was. 12, I don't know. One of them was of Saturn devouring one of his sons. Now those of you who don't know. Saturn I forget what he was the Roman god of. But he was a Roman god. Jupiter was his kid. Neptune and Pluto were also his kids. Okay. Um. <laughs> basically the only one he didn't eat was um jupiter because jupiter's mom was like nah fuck this take this fucking stone child wrap it in a blanket and give it to this motherfucker because i'm tired of him doing this um i guess saturn was what's called a titan which is like literally a giant like this motherfucker's like a walking skyscraper and uh he some prophecy had told him look your kids is gonna over your son. You will be overthrown by your son. So he felt if he killed all his sons, they couldn't overthrow. I don't know. It was some weird shit. Some really, really weird shit. Anyway, so Goya painted a picture of of him devouring one of his sons. Now, as I'm doing this reading, Pluto is the god of the dead. Pluto is also the furthest thing from us in our solar system okay now keep in mind saturn and jupiter and as far as planets they're right next to each other which is a little bit ironic that the one son that he wasn't able to kill now is like right next to him it's weird how all this shit from mythology relate to astrology it's really weird if you think about it what gets weirder is and this this is this, the term mercury and retrograde didn't make no fucking sense to me Till I looked up what Mercury was the god of. This motherfucker was the god of finance. Uh, all type of shit. Like, the god of financial success. Like, it was it basically the god of, like, doing well. You see what I'm saying? Like, Mercury was the god of doing well. However, he was also the motherfucker who leads souls to the afterlife. Or to the underworld. Is the word, the Wikipedia worded it exactly. Mercury is the closest planet to the sun. So I got to think, I said, yo, what if Dragon Ball Z is right? When motherfuckers die, they have to go on the fucking, the, the, they have to run across the highway from Pluto all the way to motherfucking Mercury, and then they reset. Yo, what if? And what if the term crossroads is like, there's a part where these, these roads is like crossed. The motherfuckers could just be like talking to motherfuckers they knew when they was alive there. Like I said, when you know so much, you worry that with your 90 fucking subs, they gonna come smoke your ass. Jeez. 